okay, don't at me for the quality of this clip, but I just, I need to film it because I am failing Vlogmas right now. Um, as you can probably tell, I have missed five days, six, I actually don't know. But I am very busy with finals right now, so I'm trying my best. I actually have the content and I've been editing it every day. I just haven't posted it because there are a couple things that aren't ready. Like this video, which I never filmed an intro to because I originally filmed this video back at the start of the semester, so like many months ago. But I never got around to posting it because I spent so long editing my Bali vlogs and they came out one by one by one, so. We're finally to December and Vlogmas and I needed content, so here you go. Here's an Amazon haul. Hope you enjoy. That's all. <laughs> which means I am going into an organization frenzy and trying to get all of the products that I've been wanting to organize an apartment forever. Is that weird that my dreams consist of organizing an apartment slash home? Maybe, that could be weird. But today I wanted to do an Amazon haul because I've ordered too much stuff. Uh, this is going to be a multi-day haul because I'm too excited to not open up all of my packages as soon as they arrive. I have no patience and I really want to start getting the apartment organized because I start classes next week for grad school and I ain't got time to waste. The first package is this guy. David already took the exterior box off of it to give to Minnow, who I'm sure I'll have announced before this as well, so I can talk about her. This is the first package. It's basically a bunch of containers to organize my pantry because I want to be one of those people with all of their stuff in clear containers. David thinks I'm a little bit crazy, but I'm excited. I think this is called the V-Top Mart airtight containers. I was going to go for the OBX, but they're so much more expensive and I really don't have much money to be spending on containers. Everything that I'm going to be unboxing is from Amazon because that just made the most sense for me. I almost feel like I shouldn't take everything out of this. Look how neatly organized this is right now. And I'm about to just pull everything out and make a big mess. Whatever, that's what moving's all about. I literally moved in two days ago. We're still going through all the paperwork in this process to get me officially moved in, but I finished moving all of my stuff here two days ago. We consider it moved in. This is the 20 piece set. Great, <laughs> inconsistent audio, love that. Whatever, I'm not an actual YouTuber. So there is one tall container, four large containers, eight medium containers, and seven small containers. It also comes with 24 different labels, and it looks like it also comes with a marker. Oh, perfect. A white chalk marker, I believe. Amazing. Excited. And I plan on making a whole organize with me because I've been watching way too many of those lately and it just looks fun to do. Now on to boxes that I don't actually know what's in them. Oh, these are two Lazy Susans. They are both 10 inches because I measured the shelves in our pantry and they are 11 and a half inches deep. So I didn't want to get the full one foot and then have it spilling over the edge and like having trouble turning. Yeah, so I went with the 10 inches. We'll see how that works. I'm hoping for the best. <laughs> and then what else was in there? <gasps> yes, my soap containers. Wow, that's really disappointing actually. I ordered these soap dispensers 
and I don't know why, but they only came with one actual dispenser. Okay, we'll just contact Amazon. They are glass bottles and they come with these silver sort of cappings and they're refillable soap bottles. They come with these labels to stick on the front. They have the black, the white labeling, and I was so excited about these because our current soap dispenser is disgusting, but it also comes with this silicone tray and it comes with a silicone um, funnel. Moving right along. I don't even know what this is. <laughs> They're a lot smaller than I thought they would be. These are adhesive sponge holders that you stick to the side of your sink and then you just put your sponge on it and keep them in the sink so they're not gross all over your sink counter. Ooh, I'm excited about these too. Okay, I know this seems gimmicky and David totally thought it was gimmicky, but they're toothpaste presses. You can't tell me that that kind of is a genius. And I didn't think I would need this until recently because we don't have a place to put our toothpaste. Like we just keep sticking it behind the toothbrush holder, which is not aesthetic. Not that this is necessarily the most aesthetic thing, but like at least now we can keep it from being a crumpled up container on the counter. <laughs> I don't know, I'm excited. It comes with three different ones. Uh, there are two white ones and one black one and I'm excited about that purchase, so that's all that matters to me. Oh, this is my pan organizer, my pots and pan organizer. Oh, I'm so excited to put this together. Um, I got the one that has 15 different dividers because we have way too many pots and pans. And like, we don't even have that many, but it's like either 15 or seven from the ones that I found. And we have about six pots. So not including the lids, that would fill up the whole thing. So I figured just go big or go home. We got the 15 and I'm about to completely reorganize our <laughs> cabinet drawer where all of our pots and pans are just crazily stacked. All right, we are down two. The last box. What is in this bad boy? What am I looking at? Ooh, okay. <laughs> I got an adhesive paper towel holder. Again, it seems unnecessary, but honestly, all of this stuff is unnecessary if we're being completely truthful. So I'm just having fun here. I wanna hang this under the cabinet over our sink because I don't want to have to keep moving the paper towel holder to clean that area of the countertop. We just, we don't have that much counter space and I feel like any way to get things off of the counter is a win. Yep, super simple, just a silver paper towel rod. <laughs> this tape job is pretty funky. Oh, this is my over the door basket for our sink cabinet. This is what you connect to it, and it's actually like a hand towel holder. So you put it over top of the door, and then you have a basket on the inside and a paper towel holder, or not paper towel, a hand towel holder on the outside. Well, I have more stuff coming tomorrow, so I will pick this back up on day two. Okay, there's going to be a lot of background noise in this, and I apologize for that now, but I wanna open Package number two. <laughs> Minnow's playing with pieces of cardboard right now. So package number two is four more like spaghetti style containers. So that's going to be it for this haul. I will see you in the next video where I will be organizing my kitchen and bathroom, kind of. Mostly kitchen. <laughs> see you tomorrow. Bye. <laughs> Thank you.